the interest in um, tip, which was saying that like there's a version of like the shop with instead of a target, it's got like a star, so like, they sell better stuff. Aren't you a little out of your way, Nora? Your sacred lands don't extend this far. I go where I like. What do you do here? I'm the keeper of these hunting grounds, which means, of course, that I'm the local representative of the Hunter's Lodge. To be more specific, I oversee the leverage trials here. Not that a vagabond Nora has any chance at passing them. You might be surprised. I doubt it. Grr. So what is this hunting lodge, which I've asked so many times now? Tell me more about the Hunter's Lodge. It's a Karja tradition. Noble families have run the lodge for generations. We compete to hunt the most dangerous machines. You've already won three half-sons. So you're eligible to enter the lodge in Meridian. But don't expect a warm welcome. It's a noble institution, not a drinking hole for savages. Grr, so savage, Tell Grr. me about the trials. These hunting grounds offer the leverage trials they focus on gaining an edge by leveraging machines against each other. You might, for instance, take a weapon from one machine and use it on another. Oh, that's it's hard. Cool. But the firepower is often worth the risk. It is not hard. Terror arrows are OP as fuck in this game. Because of that. So how did you wind up here? I didn't wind up here. It's an honor. I don't expect you to get it. But I'm well regarded at the Hunter's Lodge back in Meridian. So much so that they sent you out here to pitch your tent in the wilds? Are you going to take part in a trial or stand here prattling at me? I'm gonna prowl at you. To annoy you. Let me know which trial you're interested in. Alright, what have we got? For this trial, you must use the cannon on a Ravager's back to take down other machines. You can shoot the cannon off, or use that special spear of yours to take control of the Ravager and make it fight for you. Oh, and How here's you a special that? tip. Try using Tear Blast arrows on Ravager cannons. They'll knock them off in one hit. See, even you know the Terror arrows are OP as fuck. <laughs> Good luck. You'll need it. It's like, hey, use terror arrows. They literally just remove the weapon in one hit. Okay, let's -a go. Fuck it, go though. <laughs> Why the fuck do you? Oh. oh no. Oh no, cringe! Huh, oh, he's actually soaking. Perfect. Oh no! My legs, they're broken. Damage should heal and plants be more common though in this game. They are so fucking rare. Oh yeah, we finally got a skin. Honestly, almost overtimed though. Where was that weapon which I wanted to use next? <clears throat> yeah, it's a frost weapon, so it'll work. I honestly probably should keep my um, rope caster out for now though.
Dude, that's a lot of damage. Let's just increase the frost so it freezes shit easier. What were we doing again? We were gonna get concentration, I think. I might need to swap back to the other thing though. So, how much freezing do we have to do? Smoothing in. Shing, shing. Things are weak to ice. I can't believe it. You've earned a blazing sun on the first try. I know who you are, girl. The Nora who can control machines. So I've got a trial just for you. Use your spear to take control of two Ravagers. Get them to help you take down a Thunderjaw. This one might actually be quite difficult for the fact I need to control two different things and take down the Thunderjaw. Or I could just maybe nuke down the video. So it's time to begin. I'm just worried about the time on this one. Like, it's probably gonna be like, haha, you failed the time limit. Because we give you like two minutes to kill this. To mind control two enemies and take down a thunder jaw. I was joking when I said that. Why did it have to be true? Oh nice, the gun went on the floor though. But now I have to find the other one. Much slider. I'm a red bellied, red eared slider. Look at that, I've already wasted a minute though. Oh crap. Mm. Get crunched! We got a disc launcher though, which is good. God, stop. Stop getting lucky and just like preventing me from doing attacks. Oh yeah, we got the luminous binding though. I think we actually did. We got the we got the thing we wanted as well. But yeah, Thunder Jaws are actually quite easy to take down. Just for the fact that they have those disc launchers, and if you knock off the disc launcher and shoot it into them, it does so much damage. And they have two of them, so you can probably- if you knock both of them off, you can easily just kill it with its own weapon. Also, these mind control things did help a lot. Because <laughs> they do actually deal a lot of damage too, like their weapons. But we did almost overtime as well. No, we didn't. We still had a minute. Still a little annoying though that you had to do um do the mind control thing. Yeah, well while we're here we might as well do uh nah. We'll we'll complete the quest then we'll do it. So what's the crystalline binding weapon? It is this one, isn't it? The Kadja Sling. 
The Kelby Slingshot. A broken ass weapon. I, I can't believe it. You've earned a blazing sun on the first try. Do you really have to do the hand gestures? Can I even do this challenge? Because it says... It's written in the way that I have to control the... Thunderjaw. I suppose you just take... I suppose it's take the weapon from the Thunderjaw and use it on... Ravagers? I have to go. As you like. But we need to take down... These. These nuts! Ha! Got him. Ugh, burn. The Kaja Slingshot. The Kelby Slingshot. Burn! Increase fire damage. I thought this was weak. No, tall legs are weak to a shock, not a let. Not frost, aren't they? Fuck. It was at that moment I realised I'd fucked up and got the coding incorrect. Well, guess we'll have to fight melee. Oh no, they're not aggroed yet. Going to buy more potions. Potion seller, I'm going into battle and I need some of your strongest potions. Money, what is money? I'm poor. Poor AF. Poor as fuck, boy. Good point. How much inventory space do I have? How close is my inventory to being full? Wait, did I get another bind in? Oh my god, I have so many loot boxes. I got quite a few luminous bindings. We'll sell later. Here to try your luck again. Yeah, sure, I can slay you out. For this trial, you must use the Thunderjaws cannon to destroy ravagers. You can shoot the cannon off, or use that special spear of yours to take control of the Thunderjaw and make it fight for you. Oh, and you may want to use Tear Blast Arrows on the Thunderjaws cannon. One hit will knock it right off. But which one's a cannon? Very well. Get out there and give it your best. <sighs> like, I assume the cannon is the thing on its face because the... Wait, remove disc launcher. Hmm, this might actually be quite difficult, this one. Fuck, neither of the... Neither of the lines lead to the... Thunderjaw, though. That's what she said. This is gonna be difficult, probably, to grab, though. A bit more difficult when it literally just teleports me. Gotta move on with the egg. Come on. Come on, egg. Oh, great. He's just like, I'm a main character, so you can't escape. 
I thought I had a thing which sped up the speed you move with the fucking thing. That was not, that was not sped up. That was so fucking slow. I might have to aggro both the things. What she said. Nah, I can't do this. Like, it's just trolling. Okay, it did pick up though. Okay, this is going to be almost impossible, I think. Alright, it's going to be almost impossible, but there, there might be a way to do it. Like, we might have to terror the... Terror the Thunderjaw. Get the thing off of the Thunderbolt with Terror Shot, then use the Rope Binder to keep it un unable to move so it can't just one-shot me. Whilst I'm messing around with the uh, other things. Lost a bit of health. Okay, it's ballista bound, now it can't move. Okay, I'm gonna have this is gonna be really difficult, I think. Seem to aggro them, so it might. We might just attack the Thunder Jaw and then it should bring them in, hopefully. Might. Nah, I should weaken the things first, so try and terror the. Use the terror arrows to get rid of both their weapons as well, so they're forced to melee. Hopefully, I can't blow myself up. Which I probably can. Annoyingly, it starts on an incorrect weapon, because, you know, funny. Oh crap, that wasn't where I was meant to land. Oh well. That was a miss completely. Fuck it, I think that's close enough. Okay, now where's my terror arrows? God, we may, may have a problem. What's that? 
What the fuck just happened? I think he just soaked it like a boss. I think an, he just got an ad to soak that. Fuck's sake. Okay, so next time we have to make sure that we get as much health off them as possible. Before we even start the fight, we have to do a fuck ton of damage to them. It's so annoying that I have to equip the fucking weapons every single time as well because I didn't have the things equipped. That was no that was nowhere near here. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> magic. Where the fuck is that coming from? He doesn't have a gun. How is he shooting? I might actually not be capable of doing this because of not enough damage. I don't think I can do this. I just can't. I can't fucking do it. I just don't have enough damage to deal with them. Alright, I have a very, very stupid method of doing this. Which might work. because I got rid of the weapon. Did he just teleport on top of me because he fought funny? Where's the other saber main? Good, the plan worked. But now we just have to escape. Because this isn't Moonglade. We shouldn't be here. Escape. Go see the world. 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 You know what? Actually, we can fight this thing. It's 
shouldn't have a gun anymore on the side of its head. If I get this shot right... I'm, I'm sure that you can get rid of those. How is it spamming those when I'm... the other world. Psychic energy. Oh, fuck's sake. He has too much psychic energy coursing through him. He can predict anything I do now. Why'd that do also a little damage when the head's meant to be a weak spot? Maybe the head's broken. Good, now the heart is exposed. Just make sure to be behind a rock, because it can't go through rock. I think it's auto-aiming me the wrong way, just for laughs. Devil Joe, Mecha Devil Joe. Oh shit, a Mecha Devil Joe that can hit me through rocks. Oh come on. Oof. That was an awful attempt. But we at least completed the trial of the Crusader. I cannot say that we did a good job though. Now oh, Shin. Fuck. Oh well. I require healing herbs. <coughs> oh no, my legs, they're tiny. I can't believe it. You've earned a blazing sun on the first try. Yeah, on the first try. Gotta do them hand gestures. I have to go. As you like.
Oh yeah, we got a new skill. Let's uh, call a mount and get to the new place. Oh no, my legs, they're shattered. Shit, I forgot to do that. Oh well, we'll do it next time. Hopefully inventory doesn't fill up. Go, 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 go. Ooh, food. Please be food and not some shitty thing. Yeah, boy. sake. I wanted to open the thing because I thought it's tramplers, flame billows and rock breaker for freeze. Ravagers are weak to fire, interesting. Might need this. Well, it looks like we're gonna come back here later. This place empty yet But I'm pretty sure we come back here for story reasons. Ancient vessel, the Odyssey. Crack batter vessel that the ones once did to the old ones. It shows a legendary Odyssey. It only costs a soul. It only costs the small price of your very soul. Huh? Death from the sky, Peachcraft. Let's go there then. I was gonna head to, off to Meridian now, but I forgot that we got that quest from that dead guy. Shit, I don't know the way out though. Is there only one way in and out? I'm gonna assume there's only one way in, so we're gonna go out the way that we entered. Oh shit, my sling has no ammo. Do not touch that. Oh no. That's bullshit. That's actually bullshit. I was sure I had space still. This is my own fault though. Oh nice, I actually burned him in one hit. Oh yeah, but I forgot. I forgot to equip the fucking thing. Oh no. A trap! Ah! A trap! Mm.
Oh no. Bit of a little bit, bit too much of a big circle, I think. Like, if it's big enough to literally hit you when you're running away from it, then it probably should be a little bit smaller. Wait, did I say a little bit smaller? Massively smaller. Missed. It's, uh, it's psychically moving towards me. Stop shooting psychic orbs. Mm. They shouldn't be homing. Mm. This is so dumb. This is actually so dumb. That'll help. No way! This is actually... He's somehow just not taking hits. Okay. Just keep clam. Turn yourself into a shellfish. Hmm. I thought I instantly killed them. Annoyingly, it prioritizes um, looting over actually dodging. Oh no, you have no hands! What are you gonna do? You gonna cry? Maybe shit your pants? Maybe piss and come? Die, insectile humanoid! Okay, so... Got too many modifications. What the fuck am I missing from my bar now? One the sling what I was using before anyway. Okay, so where the fuck are we now? Ooh, a cauldron. We're doing that cauldron instead.
Luten. Whoa, okay, maybe you should uh, <laughs> make the hitbox a little lower for the uh, mounting up, because that was nowhere fucking near. Yeah, I really need to find a shop actually before I enter the cauldron though. I thought these would be empty. But yeah, I need to make some room. Oh wait, I didn't need to drop the thing, doesn't matter. It's not, it wasn't a very good thing anyway. Like, we could socket the stuff into the weapons that we have. The spare weapons that we have up our asshole. Oh no! That rabbit! It's dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Need another rabbit skin for something. Nothing of value was dropped there. Ah, oh, fuck the river. Dust feels like something. Horse was too weak of mind. Had to be dismount. Oh, a new camp. Looks like this, that's a scrapper, okay. Well, we got fairly close to Trampler. Tramplers ain't too difficult to kill. Proceeds to get my ass raped by a hand by a trampler. Just hopefully don't aggro them scrappers. Oh shit, people. Contact. People. They do not deserve living. Oh, but we need shop though before we can put, take on the tramplers. Hmm. What am I gonna do? Maybe just mind control them. They can fight each other. They can fight AMONGST themselves! Oh crap, hit my own head thing. Are you gonna come over to me? Because weirdly enough I can actually control these. Where's my one? Well, he did trample him. <laughs> Look at me, he's even got it ha caught on his horn. Okay, now time for the hard part to kill my own one. Oh, well, we don't need those. 
Uh, and time to do an office, betray my mercenaries. Oh crap, the damage is reduced because it's friendly. That's an that's kind of annoying. The fact that he literally made me have to get in melee range. Betrayal! <laughs> There's betrayers among us! There we are, he's burning! Burn! Burn! Let the corruption burn away! You're o it's too late, Mortal. You're burning. You can't stop it now. You're in overheat mode. There's nothing you can do once you're set on fire. By overheat mode. And I think we got what we needed. Nope, we got a luminous binded. Fuck. Ah, <sighs> oh well. That's a shame. What are we gonna drop? Is there a way to fast travel here? Yep. Wait, aren't tramplers weak to ice? They are, aren't they? I could have done that while I was there. Oh well, we'll fight them again. That's not rare. Wait, stealth just has really low shit on it. game just doesn't like stealth for some reason on my gear. We do not need handling. Honestly, I don't think we really need this much corruption, so we can get rid of a lot of the corruption. Oh shit, nearly sold that, and that was the best fire I had.
Now, where are the eyes? Are there any duplicate eyes that we have? Interestingly, no. actually had a little bit of different outfit. Maybe there's some more outfits I just didn't know about. Still mine has the best effect. <laughs> 